Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Slippery Gym Mate. I just woke up, which is the perfect time to show you a generic map clear of burial chambers because someone was like, hey, can you show us a generic map clear of burial chambers? And I'm like, sure. Typically, it takes me like three minutes to clear a map. And people have been asking me if I'm sustaining. I bought 50 maps when I started. You tell me if I'm sustaining. Anyway, uh, I could probably even just use just one, but I got some. What you do is you out it, and you go, I can totally do those mods. So you out and go, and that's it. Uh, if you can't do it, you scour to, ref to reroll reflect. And this is me flubbing as much as I have been because burial chambers has melted my brain. And I'm playing without any sounds on, which is fine. You're like this. You're down. I slap my blood rage, and I keep slapping it forever till the rest of time. I touch the mirror. Touch the mirror. Touch the mirror. Pick up anything that's on the sweet. filter. Sweet. Tyrone tells me there's something sweet up here. Grab that. Sweet. Go down. Go down. Go down. Go that. Use eye shot because it's the most similar to old tornado shot you can still use tornado shot but you have to invest so much money to make it good whereas ice shot is in this permanent level of just shit enough to clear the map and you can't really make it any better as a build so it's like in this perfect level to farm t7 burial chambers and you're like why t7 burial chambers well the sustain tab is why t7 burial chambers and because i want to be able to clear it and because the higher level the burials the l it doesn't make it more likely to get a doctor card the higher level you go. Show this higher pack size. I mean, if I wanted to heavily juice burials, I would do like T14 and put all elder shape of frags on it and guarantee alpha missions and shit like that. But we don't. We only want to do 75 quant out can go because that's what you can do easily, right? You can easily get 75 quant on a build. Well, you know, some builds. You can easily get 75 quant for like 7x on a build, on this build, right? And you can easily out and go maps and just everything that you get is then profit as opposed to I'm going to juice heavily and then cry on Reddit when I do 120 maps and don't get a doctor card, you know? Sweet. Anyway, I've been farming right now without paying any attention to the screen. I'm looking at it, but it's like I'm not really paying attention and that's why I flub my words because my brain is mostly turned off. Sweet. It's okay, kill this, kill this, pick up this. Clear as best I can, but you see um, how this is different to when I did 10k the first time is that was in Incursion League and it was mostly a piece of piss clearing packs and stuff but Delirium Encounters and the fact that you have to step on the little pustules to make extra mobs come out. Sure, the maps are more juicy and we're probably getting more stuff because of it but they're more painful to farm and at the same time I might not be able to kill the boss in the fog. I aim to do it but I can't always do it. Some of the people that are farming the thousands for this video, they can do it so they'll have more splinters in their um, pools at the end and it depends on whether you kill the boss in the end. Uh, depends on whether if you kill the boss in the end, you'll get more splinters from the delirium. So let's see how we got. I'm guessing like 9. We got 11. Cool. And that's uh, that's the farm. And I'll do an average from map watch to see the um, how long how long the average clear for me is. And I'll put that in this next section. But I'm going to stop recording right now. And then I'll have a cut. Time to go faster than last time, right? Uh, 35x, uh, 5 doctors, uh, ambiguous numbers no one cares about. Check the spreadsheet. Check the spreadsheet. I swear we'll have a pretty graph eventually. Anyway, here's everything. Um, technically, not everything. Um, there's all this other shit that no one cares about that's not included. Okay, here's the good shit. I got, I'm going to vow everything in here, apart from maybe some of these, because I might need this for leveling. I've already vowed a whole bunch of cobalt jewels. Actually, a whole bunch of cobalt jewels. Uh, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine-ish. Fevered Mines from half a quad tab, so two normal stash tabs of stuff. In this Val tab, there's all of these have maximum energy shield, so if I hit plus, well, if I hit negative mana reserved on there, they're money. Val these, Val that, these are all the good, these are all the jewels I pulled out that were worth money. I've already valed all the cobalts that were not worth money, and they're the ones that hit these things, and this, and this, which seem good. And I'm gonna, I like the look of this, I don't think it's worth anything, but I'll Val it. So I'll vow this, and I'll vow this, and I'll vow this, and I'll vow this, and this pulled out the saying was worth money, so maybe I'll keep these as they are. Val everything else in this tab. Val everything in this tab. Don't vow this because it's cool looking. Kept these maps because they were mirrored and some stuff that dropped like kind of decently corrupted. That's cool. I'm going to vow these. I've got one of these in my money tab down here that's got a really good roll on increased mana cost of skills and the crit chance so it's like 2x so maybe I'm not going to vow that well, I'm, I'm not I'm not going to vow that I'm, I'm going to vow all the face breakers probably and these prism shields and let's just get to it what do you want to do first I guess I'll hand in my lucky deck sets and then I'll pick up 
my lucky decks from my stash tab and then we will um, drop them all on the floor. That's what we're going to do first. So let's do that. Money, 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 all my lucky decks. I've spent shit already, I've vowed a whole bunch of stuff, so all the numbers in here aren't accurate, but the numbers in the spreadsheet are accurate. Let's go to the mine encampment because I'm perfectly fine with deleting it all once I leave the zone. Oh yeah, I don't know at what point I should mention this, but there's a thing with Awakening Level 7, and I'll have a clip at the very end of the video it's not really proof, but it's the closest I've got because I wasn't streaming or had shadow play. But there's this thing with Awakening Level 7. 7% 7 chance for an additional unique item to drop from a unique map boss. Tier 7 maps means always kill your boss. People who MF at higher tiers are like, I'm going to skip the boss because it's impossible because I've delirium orbed this zone and all that crap. Make sure you kill the boss because on my 421th map I got a headhunter drop. So, excluding my five Doctor cards I got from this. Uh, my five from the previous ones, I borrowed three from the person who did 2,000 to get this div set. I got five from this div set, I paid back the three from... I paid back the three to them, so now I've only got two. But, I came out of this, I came out of this 2,000 maps that I've done with two Headhunters and two Doctor cards. So, not bad, I think. Not bad. So I'll include that in the loot and in the notable loot section, probably, once the video is up to not avoid spoilers because I've already filled the notable loot section with how many face breakers and stuff I've got. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Anyway, stack decks on a relatively strict filter. Also, I'm going to modify this filter. Well, I'm not going to modify this filter. I'm going to modify an uber strict filter from scratch for when I do, um, like, a hundred and something simulacriums because I want to really not pick up anything with simulacriums. I want to mega strict the fuck out of it. On one hand, I'm like, I really want to pick up everything and then show you, but I am I feel like everyone, the only one, the only people that would serve are people who aren't playing the league right now and want to come back and see what it was like when simulacriums were juicy and not nerfed into the ground because standard. But, um, I don't want to do that. I just I uh, my I gotta I gotta save my fingers the pain because I've already put them through so much and quality of life to my actual self as opposed to not my actual self. I'll just get a, run a really strict filter and then compare all my loot to like MBX and MP and stuff like that. That seems like a good video and see um how many like voices we can. I've I've only run one simulacrium so far. <clears throat> and I was like, these seem cool, I'm, I'll save them all for a video. And now that I've got like 150 sitting in my stash, I'm like, hmm, I really should make that video. Anyway, keep dropping stuff, 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 drop, 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 over here, drop, 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 fuck. <clears throat> I'm not losing my voice, you're losing your voice. And this 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 and fuck and this and this and the only div cards I'm gonna hand in. I did get a lot and I've got a really badly sorted div card stash, but I I went through it all and just grabbed the RNG div cards. They're the only ones I'm ever gonna hand in in these videos. So maybe Emperor's Luck, but definitely the Tinkerer one and the voids and anything that's like the result is RNG. If the result is three fusings, we don't need to hand in that div card because you know what we're going to get. Uh-huh. Hey, Nana. Wait for it. Yeah, I'll drag the table out if it's not there and I'll just tell him to leave it on the table. It's there. Okay. See it. All good. Uh, Nana was referring to me ordering KFC because, first of all, didn't know KFC delivered to here. Second of all, it's been a month since I've had fast food, and I think I figured I'd reward myself for completing another thousand with some delivered fast food. I'm gonna sanitize the absolute shit out of it, despite the fact that I know that they're sanitizing the absolute shit out of stuff because they wouldn't be open if they weren't sanitizing the absolute shit out of stuff. And the only reason they're probably on the delivery service now is because like they was they weren't before they weren't before all this lockdown shit they they've gone onto the delivery service because they're getting way less like they shouldn't be open because because they shouldn't be but they're sanitizing a whole bunch of shit and I guess it's keeping some people with jobs which is great so if I can order delivery and get benefit of food out of it I'll do it and I I wanna I wanna reward myself for um go fuck yourself 
Um, no, I want to reward myself because, yeah, fuck you, I don't have to explain myself is what I'm saying. But yeah. Okay, like disposition. Jimmy hungry and Jimmy want food, okay? Ignoring the fact that every other time I've eaten chicken, yes, I ate chicken again, I probably shouldn't have, and I had a bad time. But KFC probably won't count to that, right? I'll let you know in the update video for whether KFC counts to that. Oh god, I hope it sure doesn't count to that. Anyway, and if you have no idea what I'm talking about, you're better off not knowing. Ah, <sighs> and then this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this... Just put it there, because I can't pick anything else up. And this, and this, and this... Okay, and this, and this, and this... Dude, can I just make a set? Probably not. I'm picking all of this stuff up again. I'm dumping in my div stash, which isn't my stash for 10k burials, it's my stash for my divination cards. And then I'll forget about it, like you do with most divination cards. Yes, it is very good. Tyrone, I'm glad you appreciate it. And that, and that, and that, and that, and that. Sweet! Picking up all this cup. Crap, crap, cup, 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 cup. Cup, 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 cup. Should I go order my food now? Sorry if you're hungry and now I'm talking about food. Should I go order my food now so it's done when I'm done the video? No. I'll save and then just wait patiently like a normal human that is shit at uh, multitasking. Anyway, I'll grab this, 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 this. Oh, another void. We will definitely hand in that other void then. Because it's RNG meme stuff. We did get a tabula set, which was weird. We got like 10 tabulas. Which are, um, rest in peace, that tabula that I accidentally vowed. But we did get 10 tabulas, and we got a tabula set somewhere in here. But, um, void card goes with the other voids, and then I'll just dump all this. Fuck it, I'll just dump it in here and sort this crap out later. Chayola Pure Breachstone, that was cool. Tabula, an Orb of Annulment card. Chaos Orb. Little hope offering the goddess fidelity spike. I'm pretty sure I saw a Farrell's card in there. That's pretty cool. Um, ding dong, ditch that. And how much are these? Probably more than an X. Cool. And like two X and div cards right there. It's pretty neat. Uh, hand in these, and these, and these. Don't really necessarily have to hand in those because you know what you get. So. We'll just hand in these, and these, and then the voids. I sh probably should have kept track from the beginning how many of those Tinkerer's Table fossil cards we get because they come, they show up literally everywhere, like in every map, so it'd be cool to get the rates, but I don't care, we'll do it as another league maybe when it's not Delirium because Delirium makes everything fucky. Here we go. Five fossils of dense, five fossils of jagged, five fossils of dense, of five fossils of dense, five fossils of dense. Okay, five fossils of etheric, five fossils, oh wait, currency, and currency, and currency, and currency, and currency. Cool. <coughs> Clo th clearing. Clote clearing. Throat clearing. Throat clearing, Jim. You fucking dyslexic piece of shit. I'm not dyslexic, I'm just overtired from farming burials. This is my yellow tab of everything yellow. <coughs> and some currency overflow. And some stuff that I haven't really counted towards anything. A 20 blasphemy, oh my god. All that gar garbage. ID, ID stuff and move on with your life. Okay. No wait, void cards. Void cards and move on with your life. And then ID stuff. Yes. Okay. And everything in here is worth stuff. So like 2x and 1x and stuff. And this might be worth money and these are good rolls. Two of these dropped from one metamorph. Which was disappointing and exciting at the same time. Uh, we'll hand in the voids, and we'll also BAM! 168 BAM! 167 BAM! 177 BAM! 158 garbage! ID these so I can vow them, ID these so I can vow them. You don't have to guess anything, it's fine. BOOM! 723 BOOM! 700 on the fucking nose, 615, 736, 626, 752, 636, 709, 606, that's a nice one, 735, 643, 781, 714, 721, Okay, I don't really care about saving these for double corruption because if I wanted to double corrupt something I'd eat a fucking queen of the forest in there, wouldn't I? So let's vow the- I don't- you don't vow these, do you? You vow everything above- up here. Okay. And I'll also have some beta bets and some nice cobots to vow. I'll remember that. Boom! Nothing. Boom! Nothing. Boom! Nothing. Boom! 
Nothing boom, nothing boom, nothing boom. Shit. Boom, 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 nothing boom, nothing boom, nothing boom, nothing boom. Hey, I'm just really good with my RNG luck, so I'm just gonna vow these real quick. One white socket, that's cool. 5% uh, chance to block spell damage and nothing else, and then vow all the drill necks and get a whole bunch of shithole projectiles that you pierce. Yeah, I don't think that's worth anything now that I don't pierce. <sighs> okay, and we vow beta breaths for like discipline effect or something like that. Nope, nope. Maximum energy shield, that might be good. No, 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 no. Air of effect. I think the maximum percentage energy shield one is fairly good. We can price check it after. I don't have to hold down shift to Denks. Every Denks and strength. Denks and strength. Strength and dex. God, I'm dumb. Uh, maybe that one and that uh, and that one might be worth something. I don't know if valing these is, do it, is worth doing, but I'm a val them all and hit one white socket on all the left hand sides. My RNG is all over the place. And I got a val, I've already valed those, um, where the fuck is it? I actually don't know where I put them. Oh, they're in here with my, my shit to val. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. Anyway, these are all the ones if I hit mana reserved on them, they're money, so let's see. Nope. 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 No. Damage. No. Hey, look, that's money now. No, no. Oh, fever mine. Forty percent. Oh my God, they're getting price fixed. But I'll have to actually check the price of them. Fever mine. Thirty-eight. Not bad. This is really good uh, so far. Curse of silence. Corrupting blood. Damage pen. Dude. Cold damage. Increased maximum energy shield and energy shield ga gained on hit. That's like pretty good. I mean, even ignoring the energy shield gained on hit, um, this is power overlay. Please stop asking. Uh, we go this and we go this and we scroll this down because roll doesn't really matter and it's like 5x and then we have cold damage on it and roll it down <coughs> it's like 16x but what about this and we roll this down so just generic increased energy shield so it's like 5x yeah so not really much for increased energy shield but adding cold damage to it is like yeah so I can sell this for like 15x or something, maybe. Got a vowel or the fuck where the vowels go. I'll just grab some. You do, you got a vowel or the cobalt. Already did that. You got a vowel or the anvils to get block chance. This is good as well. This is good as well. This might be good. And that's probably not good, but I'll take it out. That stuff I've already vowed. Vow these for block chance. Vow these for I don't really know what you go for in ambulance, but. You don't hit it, and then you'd be happy with your... Oh, a whole bunch of stuff actually hit. Block chance, no. 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 Block chance, no, no. Dude, none of those bricked. That was interesting. And then, I'm pretty sure I got another one of these somewhere. Uh, I don't know. I could have sworn I had another one. Maybe it's in my... Ah, shit, I might have vended it. You know what? I do go through a weird sorting process. But I'm about all of these, because why not? Since we're, um, we, we have all the money in the world at this point and we don't really care. The richer you are, the more gambles you can take. Hmm. And then the more they can pay off. And then you brick everything else and it doesn't matter. See? And that, and that, and this, and this. I don't really know what I'm going for, but like, the whole meme these days is... Ah, uh, reduced mana reserve suddenly makes whatever you're vowing worth a lot of money, uh, etc. Bum, 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 bum. Don't know what the EK Nova boys are going for, but I don't think it's self-flagellations. I think it's reduced mana reserve, and I didn't get it, which is fine. And same with the Frozen Trail boys, they want reduced mana reserved, and I didn't get it. Don't think these are worth any worth vowing, and now they're definitely worth nothing. These are worth like 30c. And uh, now they're not, although this one's still probably worth 30c, and this is now worth nothing, and these are worth like 5c, and now they're worth... Oh, that one might be worth something more, so we'll pull it out, have a look at it. Might of the Meek with Corrupting Bloods, 4x, that's cool. And this and this and this with minion damage, please. Can't be cursed with silence, increased generic damage. I don't know if that increased generic damage works on minions or not. Can't be cursed with silence, it's pretty cool. Um, this is pretty cool, um, and I'll price check everything else later on, but I won't show you the price checks. You'll just go, Jim, that thing you got was pretty cool, and I'll go, gee, thanks. Anything else we're missing? Handing in the voids? I think I'm done valing stuff. Price check, uh, this. 
price check this. Just give me like, uh, okay, sure. And give me like, I don't have to have everything. No, 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 no. I don't want everything on. I just want to know with like the total all res. Yeah, okay. So this one probably with like all this shit turned off. But with like increased maximum energy shield. Yeah, not as much as I thought. Oh wait, no, yeah, that's right. Okay, so they're not worth anything. Maybe they are. I'm, I'm shit at pricing stuff most of the time. Unique maps, not what I want. Okay, I'll drop these back in here. I'm going as relatively as quick as I can, but it tends to slow down, doesn't it? Do 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 do. All oh, right. Um, Harold. Got some heralds that are worth something, that's cool. What else is worth something? Aura. Aura stuff is worth stuff. Uh, just generic small with, uh, fucking small cluster with resist, resist, resist. So half of these are stuff worth rolling and then corrupting and all that jazz. And I'll, maybe I'll do that later on and edit it into this video, but I won't waste your time with doing that. I will waste your time with handing in these voids. Let's go. Boom. Boom. Glacial hammer. I know someone who would want that, weirdly enough. Boom. But he's probably got everything he wants in his life. Boom. Five ulna tolls. Boom. Forty wisdoms. I actually want wisdoms. So that's okay. One gem cutter. Nice. Another void. Wailing rage. And a fucking ring. And a storm cloud. And a veil orb. And a fucking necromancer silk. Cool. Uh, hey, I can ID these, and then I can vendor them. Wow. That's, that's a pretty cool life roll. Anyway, I will roll some jewels for Valing, and then edit that at the end of this. And then at the end of the very end of this, I'll put the uh, head on to drop. Not so much drop, just aftermath kind of clip thing. Yeah. Uh, I spent like a hundred and forty-eight chaos to roll these, and I've got just enough hours. Well, plenty of hours. Uh, mana reserved, right? And money? Boom. Corrupting blood? Boom. Nothing? Boom. Nothing? Boom. Cold pen? Area of effect? Nothing. Non-damaging ailments? Nothing. Minion damage? No. No damage elemental crit chance. Maybe I just do it quick. There we go, that way, that way I don't have to fucking read each individual one, I can just price check at the very end, not price check, I can just I can just search at the very end, that makes way more sense, since I can just type, one of those was corrupted, I must have misclicked, uh, reserved, boom, we got one, let's go this, we go pure guile, we go the amount of passive skills, we go reserved, we go two, search, 4x, the cold res one, I mean pure guile will be on cold res, so yeah, 4x, nice. So I spent like 100, I spent an X to make 4X, but it's a gamble. You, everything's a gamble in this thing, and corrupting blood might be worth something for, to someone, and all that jazz. That's just more shit you can do with your loot. Ah, <sighs> that's everything. I'll put the clip of me being speechless after this, and I'll uh, see you in the next video. See you in the next, see you in the, see, see you in the next thousand. I, I wasn't streaming. I, I, I. I killed, I killed, I was doing some farming. I killed, I killed, I killed the boss. This, this, this dropped off the, off, off the boss. It dropped identified. I wasn't recording. I didn't have screen capture. I don't have fucking any shadow play. I can't prove it. It just dropped from the fucking... It dropped from dropped from the boss identified uh, like uh, that's the first headhunter I've ever gotten like naturally from dropping What's the... Yeah. I... 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 It's... 
like apparently there's a percent chance to drop leak specifics. I'm I'm I've I I am fucking this I am I have no words. Like Like it's not Okay. Just gonna include that in the loot the loot video then, I I guess. I'm <sighs> I think I'm gonna have a break.